Plans to revamp Confluence Park could end up costing double. The city is asking for millions more after the discovery of coal tar, a known carcinogen. Now, in a month, construction is expected to start back up. Denver 7's Liz Gillardi has more about this project on hold. Yeah, I'm just tired of looking at it. To me, it's a little bit of an eyesore. Known as the birthplace of Denver. Confluence Park waits in need of a facelift to live up to that title. And I honestly don't see how you can say no. You can't leave the thing in a half-constructed manner. Originally, city officials said the project would cost a little more than $4 million. This week, they're asking council for more money to re-engineer it after discovering coal tar, abruptly stopping the project last year. Getting cleaned up and... Uh, finish the project. When it's all said and done, Denver Parks and Rec estimates the cost will be anywhere from seven to eight point five million dollars. It's difficult to say exactly um, because of the nature of the material. Um, as we proceed with construction, uh, depending how much we uncover, that'll determine how much money we actually spend. Council Member Raphael Espinoza told me on the phone he's frustrated because he believes the city lacked due diligence when signing off on the project. I wouldn't want them to shortcut it, and if there is an issue and it could create a health issue for other people, I think they need to spend the extra money and do it the right way. The work includes a reconstructed plaza, improved bike and pedestrian access, all part of a master plan to make this park look like the birthplace of Denver should. Oh, absolutely. It'll be a delight to have it done. And that was Liz Gillardi reporting. Now, construction could, should start up within the next month. The city would like to see it completed sometime next summer.